Hello and welcome to our Kingdom Conversation. Uh, today we're starting a new series of conversations. Uh, we're calling these Advent Activities. Uh, we're looking at what things are happening uh, here at St. Luke uh, during the season of Advent. Uh, we're going to be thinking about activities that are um, uh, singing and uh, choral activities, uh, service activities, family activities, all kinds of things to um, assist in our Advent preparations as we prepare uh, for the coming of Christ Jesus at Christmas. And today I'm excited. Uh, we have Pastor Elamine Begor uh, joining us for this conversation. Welcome, Pastor Begor. Great having you. Yeah, uh, thank you. Thank you to have me. Uh, I'm Pastor Begor. Uh, I, uh, I have. Um, I have been working with the Sudanese uh, uh, community among, uh, among them in Lansing, um, uh, with the St. Luke Lutheran Church. Um, I have uh, worship service uh, at uh, 6 p.m every Sunday and, uh, and also I work with uh, uh, in morning uh, uh, English worship uh, helping and I do also um, with um, helping uh, community, uh, community kitchen, uh, community kitchen uh, for to serve and to prepare the youth uh, to come and to help uh, the community kitchen. And also, um, I, uh, we have a different uh, um, activities in uh, St. Luke Lutheran Church in Christ Campus. Uh, uh, we have youth uh, uh, activities like uh, 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 Trivia night and uh, all this in uh, Saint Luke um, at Christ Campus, and uh, and also I training uh, some uh, uh, Sudanese youth to welcome uh, newcomers, immigrants. When uh, we heard that there's uh, people came in Lansing, uh, we meet them and. We brought them to the church uh, uh, to, to show them um, the love of our Lord Jesus Christ in the church and to ask them to, to fill up with us or to continue with us in, in our church. And, uh, and so we have a lot of uh, activities among the uh, Sudanese community uh, in St. Luke Lutheran Church. And uh, that's what, what uh, I am doing. Yeah, that's a lot of activities. And uh, I just love hearing about all the, the different things that, that you do and that, that the you know, Arabic speaking community at St. Luke does, that it really, it's, it's the whole breadth of the congregation, right? It's worship, it's group life of, of learning together and Bible study and, and life together, uh, but it's also service and, um, you know, just facilitating ways that we can serve our neighbors, ways that our youth can be involved. And um, it's just been over the, the many years that you and I have been able to work together. It's been uh, such a joy. And uh, I got to say, I know people that are part of this kingdom conversation. If they know you, they know this, that you are filled with the joy of the Lord. And uh, you're, you're, you're one of the, the, the most, um, uh, you're always smiling. And uh, I think that's one of the most contagious things about uh, your personality. And so it's good, good having you today and good having you uh, serving in the life of the congregation. Now, you, along with the, the, the Arabic speaking community at St. Luke, you all are preparing for a, an Advent event coming up here. And uh, we wanted to use this conversation as a time to, to talk about that event. Uh, tell us a little bit about this. What are you working on uh, coming up here? Um, uh, just uh, it's uh, 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 Sudanese uh, Christmas tradition 
uh, we want to show uh, that we always, we celebrate in, uh, uh, in Sudan every year, uh, like uh, before, uh, before the Christmas day, we always, we do like, um, uh, like Christmas Eve, uh, we, we, we will uh, celebrate singing and, 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 uh, and we singing always um, overnight. We sing overnight and we celebrate that day and, and, and uh, singing around the street, we around the church, uh, street around the church, we sing um, and uh, uh, just to prepare our heart for the Christmas day uh, that, that always, every, every year we do that uh, with all the church. We come together uh, like Christmas Eve and we sing we, uh, all overnight and uh, we around the church uh, just to let the uh, unbelievers uh, to know how important Christmas is. Mm. Uh, people that don't know Jesus Christ, we show them mm. that is our uh, celebration for the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ. Wonderful. So what I'm hearing you say uh, in, in Sudan and, and Sudanese Christians, what they do is uh, singing is an integral part of of the Christmas celebration, uh, singing for, for the joy of God's people, but also to proclaim to the world uh, the coming of, of Christ Jesus at Christmas. And so this event, it's uh, Saturday, December 11th. Is that right? Yes. Okay, yes. December 11th at four o'clock. Um, and that'll be at the Christ campus. And um, it's outside. Is that right? Yes. The okay. outside. We're singing like uh, jockeying. We see jacking and be around uh, the, the parking, just okay. jacking and singing. Okay, yep. So so singing, it'll be outside so that the neighborhood and the world can hear almost like a Christmas caroling, you might say, in, a, in an American context. So four o'clock on December 11th, uh, Saturday, that's at Christ Campus. It'll be outside, so uh, folks will want to dress warm. I'm, I'm sure it's a little colder here than in Sudan. Um, so yeah. we want to prepare for the weather and things like that. Uh, now, now, who might want to come to this? Is this something that, that do you have to know Arabic to come here? Um, or is this welcome to anybody in the congregation? Tell us about who might want to come to this. Uh, uh, we invite, we inviting everyone who has, uh, uh, how that uh, he available that time to attend uh, that uh, event. Everyone, if uh, yeah, it's not uh, just somebody have time to come, we welcome. To them. Okay, so this is you know you don't you don't have to know Arabic uh, to come here. Uh, this is for <laughs> anybody in the congregation. This would be a great opportunity yes. to. Um, to get to know uh, our brothers and sisters in Christ that are part of our church, uh, but that, that that speak Arabic, a great opportunity for that. Um, great opportunity, I think, for for children and families to come learn how how um, Christmas is celebrated uh, according to the Christian faith around the world. This would be a neat opportunity to um, invite a neighbor or a friend and say, "Hey, we're doing this neat thing at our church, and it's kind of a a global type thing." and and come be part of that. So that's great. So everybody is invited. This is not just um, Arabic speakers only, but but all people. Uh, now, I think there's something else that you had mentioned. There's going to be a, a, a particular type of dessert or, or dish that's really popular uh, among Sudanese. I've had it before. I'm a huge fan of it. Uh, I, I can't eat just one of them, but but more like 10 of them. Uh, what is this, this dish that, that you'll have there? Yeah, yeah, that is called uh, zalabia. Is kind of uh, donuts. Sudanese donuts. Uh, we bring uh, always uh, on celebration or any any time people gathering. We represent that. Uh, we bring that uh, for the event. They call uh, zalabia. 
Okay, Zalabia, and they're they're uh, Sudanese yeah. donuts essentially. Uh, yes, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and they taste uh, amazing. They are wonderful. If if anyone that's uh, part of this kingdom conversation has never had Zalabia. Uh, that in and of itself, I think, is a, a worthwhile reason to come be part of this event and 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 check it out and be part of the singing as well. Uh, well, finally, one last question. I think you you talked a little bit about this, but um, are there other Christmas traditions uh, for Sudanese uh, Christians? Uh, particular things that you know, if if we were to be uh, worshiping uh, Christ Jesus and celebrating the birth of Jesus in Sudan right now. What what might be a tradition uh, that happens around Christmas time? Yeah, uh, that uh, that just uh, we uh, that is said. Uh, yeah, we have that is called tradition. Uh, I I said before, just people they come together, uh, uh, put everything together, then they start to to make kind of uh, jacking to make uh, jacking around, jacking uh, uh, song, to make song, and then there would be around. Okay. It's called tradition. Uh, tradition. Uh, in Sudan, we, we do around the church, the street around the church, because uh, uh, different, um, uh, well, the, the, the weather is good over there, and even uh, the the the, um, the way is different to do over there than the, in this uh, country is different. And here, just we do in the parking lot. But in Sudan, we do street to street to okay. be around the church all over. Okay, so the the tradition of uh, going beyond the walls of the church, but but out into the neighborhood. Uh, singing and, and caroling and proclaiming the birth of Jesus. Uh, I like to hear how you keep that tradition going uh, here in the United States. You got to modify it a little bit, I guess. Uh, if there's snow on the ground, the parking lot's the only place plowed, so you, you stay around there, but uh, still um, going beyond our walls, uh, like our theme for the year, and go, uh, and how, how the Christmas tradition in Sudan is to, to go and uh, make a joyful noise unto the Lord uh, for the whole world to hear. So that's wonderful. Well, thank you, Pastor Begore, for uh, taking time to be part of this kingdom conversation. Uh, again, for those of you that are, are part of this, uh, December 11th, uh, that's a Saturday at 4 p.m. Uh, all of folks are invited. That'll be at Christ Campus. It'll be outside. So dress warm and uh, think of it as kind of a sort of caroling kind of thing. And there'll be Zalabia and I think some hot tea and so forth. And uh, just a great opportunity to uh, learn more about the uh, brothers and sisters in Christ that we have from Sudan and from around the world. Uh, so uh, thanks for being part of this. And God's blessings yeah. to you all. Uh, there's something. Uh, oh, yeah. The tea, tea and coffee, they, uh, that would be there too. Okay, perfect. You got to have something to wash down the Zalabia with, right? <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah. Go with that. that yep. idea. Very good. Very good. Well, God's blessings to you all. Thank you.